Hold up. Yeah. Hold up, guys. Cut. Cut. Cut the reel. Cut. Cut it. I have a confession. I'm not a actor. I don't know anything about acting. I don't know anything about YouTube. I'm not a YouTuber. But what I am is, first and foremost, my name is Hector Aldana. I'm a real estate broker for my company, Agent San Francisco Real Estate, luxury listings and home loans here in the city of San Francisco, particularly in North Beach. If you guys know North Beach, hello, how are you today? I wanted to bring to you something very interesting, but in order to do so, I have to be real comfortable. I don't like this whole idea of realtors and ads and all this stuff in the show, right? This is a bad time. <laughs> I want to be myself, so I'm going to take my coat off, do what I do when I get a listing or I'm working on a loan, take my coat off, roll up my sleeves, and you know what? I get to work. So what are my three points videos about? Just three topics within the city of San Francisco about lifestyles, real estate, the ins and outs, the who's who, the finances in the city, the changes, whatever's going on for that particular week. Every week, I'll be uploading a new video and I'll be informing you. If you want, you could subscribe to my YouTube or Vimeo channel, or you can go to my website, agentsanfrancisco.com, subscribe to the weekly and daily statistical reports, and you can get my information there. So ideally, I hope you learn from me. I hope you learn from the show because that's what I really want to do. Educate you about the city of San Francisco and how wonderful it is to be here. Thank you. My name is Hector and let's get on with the show. Point one. So today we're going to be discussing the 2017 home condo statistics for the city of San Francisco. We're going to be discussing such items as medium home price sales ratios, medium home prices for sales, actives and listings, days on the market and overall inventory supply and demand. The medium sold price is $1,275,000. The median new listing prices is $1,295,000. The current active median home prices is $1,339,000. Sales to list price ratio is 107%. The median days on the market is not your typical 30 days, but 14 days. The current active inventory in the entire city of San Francisco is 307 properties. In summation, the current low interest rates on the 30-year program and the interest rates continue to be one of the driving factors. The rate coupled with the current low supply and high demand is still the driving force and is the main reason why this market is super high. All right, so if you're gonna put a offer in to purchase a property, it's a very fierce and competitive market. So what I suggest is one, make sure you have a 15 to 20 day close of escrow period. Two, make sure you're offering at least 7% over the listed price at minimum. Make sure that you're wary of your competition. Three, make sure you have your financing in place. Right now, it's low interest rates, high demand, low supply. It's a very fierce market. You have to be competitive. You have to fight for that property. Point number two, 30 year fix. Wow, January 2018, current 30 year fix is lingering at about 3.85 with full dock, qualifying 7.25 with scores. We're looking at good rates right now. First week of January 2018, rates popped up about an eighth of a point, following the same trend that we saw in 2017, January, 2016, January, 2015, January. We're seeing the same rate in trends, three and a half to 4%, and they keep going up and down, you know, within that range. So what are we expecting? The future of 2018? Well, we're looking about the same. Right now, our economy is not that strong. The dollar is seemingly a little bit stronger on Wall Street, but we have a $22 trillion national debt. We're in a uh, house of cards right now, so if that dollar becomes weak, you can expect rates to keep about the three and a half to 4%, right? If our economy gets stronger, the Trump administration is very conservative. It wants to raise rates, right? It's not because it's a mean presidency. It doesn't want to really hurt people, but they want to go into a conservative mode, a saving mode. So anytime the rates go up, that means we're not lending that much money. So we fall into a savings mode, right? We're not seeing that anywhere near because right now the economy is not that strong. So we're in a spending mode. If the rates raise too quickly, that might hurt our economy. It's too fast to just jump into a saving mode in a weak economy. So yes, for the remainder of 2018, we're going to expect rates to linger anywhere from three and a half to the low fours, four and a eighth. I don't think it's going to reach four and a half. So let's uh, keep knocking on wood and hope that uh, that's the case. Point number three, 181 Fremont Street. The sleekest, most absolute building being built in the city right now. So who's the developer of this amazing building? Well, its concept came from the J-Paw Company, and they selected this very amazing interior designer, Orlando Diaz Asque. 
in a few short words, I would define this property as a groundbreaking property. It is a landmark property and it's a marvelous property. The vision for the residences here at 181 Fremont is not to raise the bar in luxury living in San Francisco, but to completely set a new bar altogether. So who's going to be a resident here? Well, of course, the properties range anywhere from $4 million to $42 million. So you're talking about creme of the creme buyer. You're talking about a buyer that has enough disposable income that it, nothing matters, right? Uh, you're talking about a buyer or a mogul that's going to come in here and purchase a, a unit without e any grace fee. HOA alone is from 2000 to 3000 not including your tackle. Can you imagine the amount of mortgage or payment that you would have to do with all the additional costs set aside from the mortgage payment? So definitely going to be uh, for the buyer that's not your average normal working person. But it is an inspiring view to see this building. And again, it's an icebreaker for the neighborhood. In fact, it's creating an entirely new neighborhood. The new neighborhood is called the Eastcott. Now, Eastcott kind of sounds kind of East Coast. -ish. They're trying to cut a little niche here in San Francisco and make this place a little bit more hipper and cooler. They're trying to introduce more residences into the commercial aspect of it. The actual building is a mixed-use building. In fact, Facebook is going to occupy many of the floors. So Facebook, this is actually a Facebook building. They're calling it the Facebook building. So above that building, there is a middle portion that just cuts the commercial part, the mixed-use part, into the residence. And within that, that middle cut basically is a like a rec room, right? But th they have outside walking areas and bars and just everything that any wealthy person would desire in a custom condo. This concludes my three points videos. Stay tuned, subscribe to my YouTube or Vimeo channels, and go to my website and subscribe to the SF Market Reports. Also, when you do that, you'll get two booklets. They're understanding real estate booklets. I write these one every month. So for the remainder of the year, I'll be providing you one, one a month. They basically give you an understanding of what real estate is. You know, topics like, you know, the loan process, topics like what are closing costs. So I go thoroughly and I explain to you exactly what it is so you know what to expect when you're either buying a house or selling a house or whatever. If it's regarding real estate, I'll be writing it. If you have any suggestions, please put them down. I'll write a booklet about that and submit it to you free of charge. Go to my website, www.agentsafrancisco.com. Also, if you happen to need me as a real estate agent or mortgage broker or you want to list your luxury home, let me know. I could do real estate anywhere in California. My number is 415-796-0086. I hope you enjoy the information that I brought to you and that I will bring to you. It is my pleasure and my joy to educate you, especially around San Francisco. I'm sure you're going to find it intriguing. Thank you and have a nice day.